Like your home plumbing system, when your network traffic is nearing its capacity, your internet access can be congested and backed up. This congestion can significantly reduce your video conference or internet phone experience. The core function of the Firewall at SmartQ is to help you better regulate network traffic, reduce buffer bloat, and improve network performance when your network is under load. Let's tap on the SmartQ button and turn it on. When the SmartQ is on, the active queue management function will classify flows and provide a fair share of the total bandwidth to all devices. This will automatically help you to reduce latency across your network. If you want to further customize your network experience, you can use the Firewall at SmartQ rules to rate limit and prioritize traffic. Traffic shaping or rate limiting is useful if you know the high bandwidth users, activities, applications, and want to reduce their load on the network. If you have important traffic like WebEx or Zoom, you can further optimize the smart queue by giving them a higher priority. To understand the smart queue better, let's look at an example. Suppose our ISP has a gigabit download and 40 megabit upload, and we're running in router mode. Since our download speed is gigabit, it would be difficult to overload this. The default smart queue should be enough to reduce burst delays. Our upload bandwidth is relatively low. We can create a simple rule to read limit the link at 90% of ISP bandwidth or 36 megabit. This will signal the active queue function to perform better. Tap on smart queue. Tap as smart queue rule. Then tap on set a target and choose internet. Tap select the device and pick all devices. Let's read limit our upload to 36 megabits and leave download as is. Tap on save. The SmartQ rule is now created. Since we're working at home these days, we like some special treatment for WebEx or Zoom calls. So let's give higher priority to these two applications. Let's add another rule. First, set the target as app and select Zoom. Then select the device used for Zoom meetings or work laptop. Set the priority to high and leave the upload download limit to none. Tap on save. You can do the same with the WebEx app. And lastly, we're likely to overflow our monthly plan this month. We can create a rule to limit all video traffic to 50 megabit. Tap on add a rule. Set the target to all video sites. Select all devices. Leave the priority to default and set the download limit to 50 megabits. Tap on save. You're all set. Sit back and enjoy a smoother network.